Hi everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how to add Google Address Autocomplete in WooCommerce using Merchant Pro. Merchant Pro is an all-in-one WooCommerce plugin that comes with over 40 modules designed to boost the sales on your store. So I'm going to go over now to my site where I already have Merchant Pro installed and I've already enabled the Google Address Autocomplete module. And to get the module working we just need an API key. It is the Google Places API key and in our documentation we go over what you need to do to get one and it only takes a few minutes. You just need to sign up for an account on the Google Cloud Platform and Google, at least at the time of recording this, give you $200 of usage every month for no charge. So unless you have a huge number of requests you should be able to use Google Maps essentially for free unless you are going over this $200 credit allowance. So once you have your key, you just copy and paste it into this field here, API key, on the module settings page. And once you've done that, you just need to hit save. And then I'm going to go onto my shop front end and I'm going to show you how it actually works. So I'm going to go to the checkout page. Let me start with an address in the US. So we can already see it showing up here. So let's say I live at one Ocean Drive. It's going to start coming up with these suggestions and your customer can just click and it will automatically fill in the town city, the state and zip. And so it just makes things a bit easier for your customers, a bit quicker, a bit more convenient, and it also means they're less likely to make mistakes. So it doesn't just work for the US, it works for lots of different countries. It will work with the UK, for example. Let's say I live at one Churchill Place in London. Again, it's going to auto-populate town city for me in the postcode. So this, it's the same principle. And that is about it. That is how to add Google Address Autocomplete in WooCommerce using Merchant Pro. If you have any questions about this functionality, just let me know in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.